hi guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here welcome to the family and if you're a day one subscriber thank you very much uh, thank you for you know hanging out with the channel with me and with everybody else our little family simply Susanna on YouTube uh, thank you very much guys for you know watching the videos as we grow each day uh, slowly but surely and God is really good and I'm so thankful for everybody who continues to support who continues to work with me I am so grateful and I hope the word blesses you I hope the videos blesses you and I hope that you take one or two things to like encourage you and to help you move you know take more steps in life and get more encouraged so guys I know it's been a while since I posted a video it's been roughly three weeks and firstly first I was I've been in a season of prayer a season of prayer because there were things in my life I just I just needed God to speak to me about and to tell me on the way forward and to like hold my hand and show me what the way is because there are so many transitions transitions I want to make in my life and I really wanted to hear God's voice and what he what he has to say about it all and so I've been in a season of prayer I've been in a season of um, getting empowered reading the word and listening to other youtubers who are Christian who have Christian based channels and it's just been a wonderful time to just listen to them and get empowered and get amazed they are such wonderful people out here people like putting out content wonderful content uh, content that is so blessing that is so empowering and that is so encouraging and it's so phenomenal and wonderful and amazing to see other women other ladies doing what God has called them to do and that is always my pride and joy like it fulfills me so much and I get to fan over these women like a little girl like you know it 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 gets me encouraged and i feel so good because it's high time it's high time women young people like take our position and do what god has called us to do you understand so i've been in a season of prayer and a, a season of just getting empowered myself listening to so many podcasts watching so many videos and you know yeah like cultivating myself some more and empowering myself some more through the help of the holy spirit of course because i've had so many revelations through other people's videos and work and art and channels and podcasts and it has been amazing i hope everybody in on here has been great the lord has kept you you're wonderful everything that pertains you is glorious you're you're in your season of breakthrough you're you're you're, be, you're blessed of the lord and you know hope that everything is working out for your good and and if it's not manifested physically it's good to also believe that it's working for your good spiritually uh, because the word of god says so that things are working for good for us who believe in the lord so it may, we may not see it physically sometimes but it is happening or it has happened already it is just waiting for it to manifest in the physical so guys today i just wanted to encourage someone or some people through a testimony that has happened to me in the few few weeks that i've been away uh, if you have watched my previous few videos before I, bro I broke out, before I had a break till now, guys, you would have noticed my face was really bad and I had really bad acne and pimples all over my face that I just couldn't understand where they were coming from and I had not had a change of my skincare routine or added something new on my face, nothing. So it had really affected me like they were really bad 
acne really hard ones like all over from my from my forehead all the way down to my chin all over my face all around even in places that i've never had acne they had come this time and they were really bad and they were really stubborn and uh, they were there were times i will really feel bad about them because i remember there was a time my mom found me and she was like yo you need to f to seek medical attention now because hey you look really you look really bad like the pimples have grown so badly you look they've spread all over your face you look you don't look good you look sick and i just couldn't understand because somehow i suspected maybe it was my my slow intake of water or my unpredictable <laughs> intake of water so i started on taking water seriously but they still couldn't change and i i even bought those the himalayan salt and took some to clean my colon i thought maybe my colon had had some too much you know toxins so i had to detox maybe my face would come back to, mo to normal and i did and yo guys <laughs> the detoxification with the himalayan salt is not a joke it's not a joke just some PSA, if you take that thing, make sure you're not going anywhere, you're just staying at home. And for more information, kindly inbox me or DM me, I'll tell you how it goes. But it's not pretty, guys. So, yeah, so after I went to these prayers, I've been praying to God and I told God, like, I need this face to look like you are. You are glorious, you're a wonderful God, you're smart, you're beautiful you're gorgeous i need this this face to represent who you are and i went into prayers crazily who goes to god asking him for a clear face this is how crazy crazy i've become in my faith believing god in every little thing in every crazy thing even things that don't make sense and i went before god and told him i really need you to show up for my face i really don't want you know there's a way you can look and your enemy sees you and, and like they just conclude that you've just been defeated by life. I told God this is not my portion. I've not been defeated by life. I am a conqueror and I need to look like a conqueror. I need to have this smooth faith. I need to like regain my 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 earlier glorious face because all my all of my life since primary school, secondary school, I've had a really soft face until my my in my youth times when i started experience hormonal imbalances and everything and that's when my face started having acne and i would also experience acne mostly on my periods which is sometimes which is normal for a woman yes so i was really just expecting acne on my face when I was on my periods, no other times. But this time it was really, really bad, and I was really questioning God and like, how come this face doesn't represent who you are? I really need a face that looks like you glorious, magnificent, amazing, and true to His word. After my prayers, I just felt the Holy Spirit talk to me, and He told me I should start a water, a warm water with salt wash on my face every day guys and you say god <laughs> we think god like doesn't speak or that is not concerned about our very little details but he is so god told me hey start a, a wash on your face like do warm water and then add salt and then be washing your face you guys i started doing that and i told my mom <laughs> i told my mom god has told me i should be washing my face with warm water and salt and she was like you know because it sounds somehow crazy but i knew what i was feeling and i know the sound of god and i know what it meant to obey him so i went ahead and you guys i had just started three days after i could see a great 
difference a great difference and when my mom saw me she was like hey this your god doesn't joke like your face looks way different you look awesome you look way smoother i was like yeah i know my god can never disappoint me so you guys um as you can see the face has regained its glory for for a bit i just have a little purging on my forehead and my you know under my eye just a bit and i believe it's ending in jesus name because you know god is just awesome and he, he's a healer it doesn't matter if it's leprosy acne on your face cancer he's a healer of everything it's just for you to go to him and he responds he cares about every little matter of our lives so thank you guys for listening to me i hope you're encouraged i hope that you can go ahead and believe in god in whatever you're believing him for however little however big it is god is just an awesome god and he will honor his word he will honor his word and he'll you know he will honor his word and he'll love on you he'll make you feel good and he'll bless you in whatever area you're be you're believing him for so guys thank you very much for listening to me and i pray that god blesses you in whatever area you're believing him for and i pray that he changes your story he changes your every area of your life that you're uncomfortable with and he continues to bless you bless you bless you bless you so thank you very much guys if you haven't subscribed to this channel i don't know what you're doing kindly go and subscribe comment share and may god bless you guys have a nice time until the next video bye